think, again, uh, you ought to draw your own conclusions uh, from what is already a public record. Uh, quite clearly, Mr. Dean was in a position uh, where he ought to be able to give us uh, helpful information. I can't say anything about information that he has to. Could I ask you this? Uh, can we assume that he would testify at other trials than simply the one involving the, the Watergate cover-up? Well, I don't, I can't uh, answer that question, Fred, with respect to assumptions without uh, disclosing uh, what information he may have given to us, and that would be uh, improper. So certainly he has uh, undertaken uh, to give all the information he can that would be of help in the administration of justice. Mr. Cox, could you tell us whether you believe any useful purpose would be served given Mr. Dean at least public contrition and cooperation that, that he receive a, a jail term? Would anything be served by that? I mean, I think that the disposition of the matter you know, was an entirely proper one. And the question of sentencing should be left to the judge and uh, determined by him when he has all the possible facts in front of him.